WVC5 Sports Desk, brought to you by Xfinity. We have been living out some of the best plays from the past decade over the last couple weeks, but why close down the polls now? I'm going to leave them open as we now look back at some of the best sports endings with the greatest games on NBC5. This week I go back to just a few months ago. The D2 Boys State Championship game, the third seeded Milton Yellow Jackets playing the top team in the Harwood Highlanders. Harwood would take a 2-0 lead with goals from Tyson Sylvia and then Finn O'Hara to give the Highlanders a 2-0 lead in the second period. But the Jackets get one back when Nicholas D'Souza backhands it in. And then in the third period, they get even on a score from Christopher Lefebvre. Somehow finishing the play, puck is in. We have a brand new hockey game, 2-2, one that would bring us into overtime. And that one saw Skyler Platt end the game less than two minutes into the extra period. Good night, drive home safely. Harwood is the 2020 Division II state champs. But then again, there was also Section 7 boys hockey, the semifinal, number three, Saranac, playing at the Rouse's Point Civic Center versus number two, NCCS. Second period, 2-1 Northeastern Clinton. Puck sent in from Chase Letourneau. Gives his team some insurance with a 3-1 lead going into the final period. In the third, Hayden Buckley and Nicholas Hamill would hook up twice. Within 90 seconds of each other, the two goals had the game all tied up. Three minutes after that, Saranac's Zach O'Connell skates down the far boards, shoots for the upper far corner. It's in. Saranac fans are going crazy as they've come all the way back to take a 4-3 lead late. But... They were not yet out of the woods. Pass sent out to Bolson, who puts it on net and in. Sends this game into overtime, tied 4-4. In OT, it would be OC. Zach O'Connell slides the game winner home. Saranac comes back for a 5-4 overtime thriller, advancing them to the Section 7 title game. Just like our top plays, the voting begins now. And we'll have results coming up for you from the best finishes on Thursday night. Ken Drake, NBC5.